kiss them goodbye. You know, time to move. Somebody is secretly planning to move you. Hello, everyone, and I welcome you to today's video. You know, sometimes, you know, uh, I noticed with myself, uh, I would find means to accept a situation. And what do I mean? I would understand that the way in which our God, the Lord God, functions is he has a secret plan. Anything, as much as it is anything good, you know, they say all things come to an end, isn't it? Uh, all good things, they're going to end. That's how they console themselves when they, uh, whatever, whatever. But the bottom line is, let me assure you, everything it is true it is bound to come to an end. But let me tell you that even something bad things, don't forget to use that line even against bad situations. No matter how bad, let me assure you, whether you are praying or not, there are things that when they are happening in your life, they are bound to, to go off. Even if not entirely, once in a while, good things can happen. Though you're not praying, but you're not doing right, some blessings will fall on you. Someone can just give you money out of the blue and you'll be like, what happened? You got what I'm saying? So like when you see the Israelites in slavery, yes, it was hard, but the time was moving closer and closer and closer until, let me assure you, there was the final day in which they suffered and they kissed all that Egypt goodbye. So that is also how you should also Look at your situations in your life. Be prepared to kiss your bad situations goodbye. They're also bound to finally come to an end. Don't let a situation trouble you enough and you think that is there for good. Remember, there, is all, there are always two sides to a coin. You know, head and tail, you know. So that's it. You know, as much as the coin is still spinning, as long as the situation, as long as life, as long as the world is still revolving, one day it's going to end. And whoever is oppressing you, haven't you seen situations where, in fact, I remember this lady, she was sharing on YouTube uh, a story once she used to date a gangster. So that guy once buried her alive, you know left the head like that you know so she said she managed to own she tried to dump him and stuff but it would be like it was like nah so she said she only survived because he eventually got killed so you see that is how she escaped him and even to this very day i believe she's still alive as far as i know you know so the bottom line what i'm trying to tell you is this anything that is holding you hostage one day it is all gonna end be it it ends you or they they end so but then that in most cases it is not necessarily that you're gonna end because some things you just know how can i end in this situation you get what i'm saying but there are things whatever they are using to oppress you it will come to an end and i pray whatever is bad in your life kiss it goodbye look at it and be like so this is the last time I ever am going to suffer like this. Sometimes I also look back and I look at my situations and I'll be like, okay, of as much as I did not know how, when it was going to end, I'll be like, uh, so it's been like a month and I've never suffered from this problem. It's been two months, three months. Now it's been a year and this situation has been gone. So it means there was that final day where I stressed about it. And the next day when I began to smile, because things were good, it became good like that for the longest. Meaning that last time actually, without me realizing, it was a kiss goodbye to that bad situation. So likewise, I pray in your life today, let there be a kiss goodbye to anything that oppresses you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And of course, you can also book an appointment with me. Others are already booking. So my details are on the comment section below. And I will see you then.